Hello friends, welcome back to Ortho Implants for Life. Today's discussion is olecranon fracture and its fixation with pre contoured plate and tension band wearing. So without further ado, let's begin. Olecranon fracture happens in the proximal part of the ulna bone. In case of an olecranon fracture, a specific plate can be used which is called olecranon pre-contoured plate. It is site specific that means it has a specific left and right because it is designed as per the curvature of the bone and it is already mentioned. Now we will see the fixation of this plate using the instruments. First, locking sleeve needs to be placed in the hole. Once a locking sleeve is attached, drilling is done through it. And then you fix a locking screw in this hole. When you are drilling through the sleeve, you can only use locking screw. Then you use a screwdriver to tighten up the screw. Always remember locking screw holds both the bone and the plate together. After the fixation of the locking screw, in order to fix this plate in the shaft portion of olecranon, one can use both locking or non-locking screw as per the surgeon's instruction. In order to use a non-locking screw, first drilling needs to be done with 2.7 mm drill bit through the non-locking hole. After the drilling is done, if required, you can use the bone tap to tap for the screw. Tapping is basically making way for the screw. Then cortical screw is attached in the hole. Always remember, cortical screw gets fixed in the bone and not in the plate. It always dynamizes the bone. And when you want to fix a locking screw, then you repeat the same process of attaching the locking sleeve first. After that, the drilling is done through it in the same way. For fixation of locking screw, tapping is not required. And this is how you fix a pre-contoured plate in case of olecranon fracture. This helps in joining and healing of the bone. At times when the fracture site is small and it cannot be fixed by plate, In such scenario, K-wire is used for fixation of the fracture. K-wire is used to hold the two fragments of the fracture. And then we use this SS wire and we tie it making the figure 8. And in order to do this kind of fixation, you just have to drill a hole in Anna. After the drilling, the K wire is fixed with the SS wire in the figure of 8. This also helps a lot in union of the bone. This is called TBW that is tension band wiring. After this, the K wire is cut from the desired length. You must need a 3-in-1 plier and a wire cutter. In order to do this TBW process, if you have enjoyed the video, please like it, share it. If you are new to our channel, subscribe it. Hit the bell icon to get the notifications for our upcoming videos. If you have any query, comment in the 
comment box. To know more about the career prospects in orthopedic implant industry, click the link given below in the description. Thank you. See you in our next video.